just like you see on this video when you are outside or when you are riding your bike if you would like to capture the visuals just like you captured it using a drone or with the help of a third party then hey friends welcome to another video what i have today is the world's best 360 degree camera on my hands one of the most premium manufacturer of 360 degree cameras is the insta 360 insta 360 has different 360 degree cameras like 1x1, 1x2, 1x3 and so on. However, just about a year before, they have manufactured a most premium 360 degree camera which is the Insta360 1RS 1 inch 360 edition. When I have thought about purchasing a 360 degree camera, obviously I had the Insta360 X3 in my mind. This is Insta360 1RS 1 inch 360 edition. Insta360 has manufactured this particular product with the help of the premium manufacturer of lens and camera accessories Leica which is based out of Germany. That is Insta360 has co-engineered this product with the help of Leica. How this camera becomes the world's best 360 degree camera is the Insta360 1RS 1 inch 360 edition has a couple of 1 inch CMOS sensors. That is the reason why this camera becomes the world's best 360 degree camera at the moment. Now let's quickly go through some of the major highlights of the Insta360 1RS 1 inch 360 edition. This camera has dual 1 inch sensors so that will help this camera to perform extremely good at low light conditions. This camera can shoot 6K 360 degree videos. It can take 21 megapixel 360 degree photos. It has flow state stabilization, 360 degree horizon lock, invisible selfie stick support. It performs extremely good at super low light conditions. It can take HDR photos. It is IPX3 water resistant. It supports interchangeable lens voice controls and auto edit. Those are some of the major provisions of Insta360 1RS 1 inch 360 edition. This is the world's most advanced 360 degree camera just because it has two 1 inch CMOS sensors. Even the advanced cameras available in the market today like the DJI Pocket 3 has only one 1 inch CMOS sensor. Obviously it is not a 360 degree camera. However, having dual 1 inch sensors that is some spec on a camera today, especially on a compact camera like the Insta360 ONRS 1 inch 360 edition. This is basically a modular camera. This camera has three major components. First component is the lens compartment and the second is the core compartment and the third is a battery component. All these components needs to be mounted together in order to function this camera. Since this camera comes up with bigger CMO sensors, the lens of this camera is obviously bigger. So that makes this camera extremely fragile. It can attract damage so protecting the lens is going to be a challenge when you are using this particular camera. Now let's see what all are included in the box. When you open the box, you can see the Insta360 1RS 1 inch 360 edition camera mounted all together and placed neatly inside the box. Even though this is a modular camera, all the three components are attached inside the box when you open it for the first time. Other than the camera, you will find some silicone, USB-C to A cable, a cleaning cloth, a lens cap, a couple of Insta360 stickers and some documentation. Some basic instructions are provided on these documents. Now let's take out the different components of this camera from its mounted position. There are a couple of buttons just on the next side of this camera. Once you press those buttons, then you can separate the lens component from the core component. Then the other two components, that is the core component and the battery component, both of them are integrated together inside a mounting bracket. Initially, it was a little harder to remove this core part and the battery part from the mounting bracket. However, after I have taken it once, it was quite easy to remove it from the mounting bracket. You will find some instructions and stickers attached to the battery and the mounting brackets. So you can remove all those stickers as well. So when you take out the components from the mounting bracket, both the core component and the battery component will come together as attached. The mounting bracket is definitely made up of plastic and it is of good quality. And now let's separate the battery component from the core component. There is a male USB-C part attached on the battery component and there is a female USB-C part on the core component. 
so that's how the core component and the battery component connect to each other you will need to insert the memory card on to the core component by default you will not get any memory card along with the insta 361 rs 1 inch 360 edition however you will have to purchase a micro sd card which supports 4k plus videos so it is always suggestible to use an ultra premium sd card as this camera captures 6k videos the performance of the memory card also matters a lot after we insert the memory card we can mount the core component and the battery component together and we can insert these two components inside the mounting bracket on top of it we have a provision to attach the lens component so that's how the modular mechanism of this camera is so in order for you to make this camera function you will have to mount these components just like you see here this camera is extremely fragile just because this camera has bigger lenses and bigger sensors the lenses are clearly exposed and if you are not taking proper care of it you will definitely damage this particular camera so safeguarding this particular camera is of extremely critical importance i have bought a couple of accessories for this particular camera here i show you a silicone case which will give the basic protection for the body of this camera since this camera has a modular design it is also required that the body of the camera is not getting too much of impact so i bought a silicone case which helps me to give the basic protection for the body you should always use a lens protection cap on this camera you will get a lens cap by default from insta360 on this packet however if you apply a silicone case the lens protection cap may not fit properly because when you are applying the silicone case the size of the camera increases by a little bit of a margin however the good thing is that when you purchase a silicone case like the one that you see here you will also get a separate lens cap which suits the silicone case and a couple of other must have accessories along with this insta 361 rs 1 inch 360 edition are the invisible selfie stick and i have also bought the insta 360 tripod stand the invisible selfie stick is a must to have along with this insta 360 1 rs 1 inch 360 edition let's see how does insta 360 makes this selfie stick disappear since this insta 360 1 rs 1 inch 360 edition has a couple of cameras attached together so the visuals of one particular camera overlaps with the visuals of the other camera then insta360 has internal artificial intelligence algorithms to detect the overlapping visuals and then this artificial intelligence processing helps the insta360 camera to disappear those common elements so that's how the insta360 basically disappear the selfie stick as well as the camera itself from the vision while you are using the insta360 desktop application you have the control and free them to make sure the selfie stick is not visible on your visuals please keep in mind that even though this is a 360 degree camera this camera has a modular design so using this camera for motor vlogging is not really advisable because the different components of this camera should always attach together and the modular design of the camera can get impacted if you are taking this camera on a pothole filled road so you have to be extremely careful while you are attaching this particular camera with your bike if you are planning to take 360 degree visuals while riding your bike also the weight of the insta360 one rs 1 inch 360 edition is higher than the insta360 x3 so if you are planning for regular motor vlogging and planning to capture 360 videos while you are riding the bike definitely the x3 would be the best option however if you are trying to capture the 360 videos once in a while attaching the camera on your bike perhaps you can still use this particular camera the reason why i bought this camera is i would like to definitely enhance the visuals of my vlogs i will definitely use it on my bike but maybe not regularly this camera has an unlimited potential you can capture the visuals that you cannot capture with any other cameras the quality of the visuals is just too good you have the complete freedom to control what you want to produce at the end of the day so you just attach the camera wherever you want and the camera does the rest it captures everything around it and once you go back home you have the complete freedom of choosing what you wanted to see and what you wanted to show and you can play with different directions the desktop application of insta360 is a breeze to 
use it is nothing complicated you may have to spend a little bit of time on it just to process the video that's all the other accessory that i have purchased is the insta 360 tripod stand this is also a must have accessory so in case when you are outside without being with anybody and you wanted to capture some visuals without the help of anybody you can definitely do it you can attach the selfie stick on this tripod stand and you can capture 360 degree videos another accessory that i have bought for this particular camera is a carry case to protect the camera definitely a hard case is required fortunately insta360 builds its own hard case for the insta360 one rs one inch 360 edition the quality of this case is also very good however if you use a silicone case attached to your camera then you may feel a bit of tightness while placing the camera and taking it out from the box however this carrying case is a must have accessory you will also get a component to store different small little accessories like your cleaning cloth your usb-c cable and so on i have ordered a separate lens protector guards for this particular camera so i am not taking the plastics off the lens as of now but i will create a separate video with this configuration setup and the installation of the lens guards on this camera all right folks that was a bit of a lengthy video with the unboxing and small little accessories for my new insta 360 one rs one inch 360 edition i am really excited to utilize this particular camera to its potential to capture amazing visuals just like you saw some glimpses on this video all right folks thank you so much for watching this video please do subscribe to this channel for similar sort of updates and you all have a great day ahead